Hey guys, what's up? It's Erica. Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. I have a very exciting video for you guys today. I'm going to be filming my dorm haul and showing you guys all the essentials and items that I bought for my college dorm. I will be attending Salisbury University this fall semester as a incoming freshman. I actually will be moving in on the 25th, which is literally in 23 days. Today is August 2nd. I am super excited for moving day and for just going to college in general. Just to give you guys a little information on my dorm situation, I will be living on campus. I did pick random and I was placed into a triple. I have two other roommates. I haven't met them or anything, but we're in a group chat we don't really talk in the group chat but hopefully the living situation will be just fine to my understanding a triple room is just a really big room with like triple of everything three beds three desks three whatever else everything behind me is going to hopefully accommodate that room i binge watched probably every single dorm essentials and dorm hall video here on youtube i kid you not just to get a idea of what people bought so everything you see here is not only the essentials and the needs but also my wants and maybe things that are a little bit unnecessary i really want to thank my mom because she was the person that like purchased all of my stuff i would send her links to like everything that i wanted and then she'd just buy it for me i really appreciate you mom if you're watching this i love you so much and Aww. i just cannot thank you enough fyi guys i've tried filming this video three different times counting this one the first time i tried to film there was awful lighting. We're gonna move you guys and see if the lighting is better here. Is it better here to like sit here and do it? It was dreary and raining and stormy. So the lighting was like really yellow and just gross. Is it cute? Is the lighting good or not? And on the second time, I filmed the entire video and I just, I guess, did not look in the viewfinder and there was a piece of my hair just like sticking out. Okay, up next is storage. Um, this closet organizer is extremely distracting. That was discouraging because yeah, I filmed the entire yeah, thing yeah, and I was really upset yeah. with myself. So hopefully this time I am able to fully push out this video to you guys. I know that moving day is coming up soon for a lot of different people. Everything you see here was purchased from Amazon, Target, TJ Maxx, and HomeSense. If you're interested in anything that I get, it will be in the description if it can be. I think that's all I have to say. There is a lot that I have to show you, so we're just gonna get right into it. So the first thing you guys are gonna be seeing is everything bed. Get into the easy stuff. First thing I have here is a pillow. This is just a normal pillow from the brand Room Essentials from Target. I got two. They're super duper cushy. Okay, moving on. Still on that subject, I have throw pillows. These are just the same two that I've had for my room. We have this leopard one. This is from Hone Sense. It's the most gorgeous thing ever. Every girl has had this pillow, I feel like. It's just this white furry pillow um, from Target. Since dorm beds are kind of small, you want to not waste the space with adding a bunch of throw pillows. So I might just bring one of those or I might just bring one of my normal pillows. But I'm definitely not having all four of my bed. That is like a lot, I feel like. Next, we're moving into bed sheets. I've heard numerous times that buying white sheets for college would be a severe don't. But I love white and I did it anyway. It says it includes a flat sheet, a fitted sheet, and standard pillowcases. Going along with that, I have my actual blanket. I don't know the difference between a blanket, a cover, and a duvet. This is, I think, a duvet. Or maybe it's a cover. I don't know. I got this off Amazon Basics. It's actually the exact bedding that I have on my bed right now. I've been in love with the design, and I think that it's so simplistic and adorable. This is what it looks like with that. I wanted to buy a blanket. I like throw blankets a lot and I always use them. This is just kind of like a gray white fur and then the inside is like cashmere. This mattress protector. I actually don't know where this is from but my mom decided to get it for me because 
she's smart. I thought of using a reused and past loved mattress from multiple people that I don't know is kind of scary and kind of gross. So mattress protectors might just be a necessity. Next, we have this big guy. This is a mattress pad or a mattress topper. This is the Linen Spa Gel Memory Foam. It was a bit of a splurge, but I've heard that investing in one of these is a game changer. Next for my bed, I have this guy over here. We're actually gonna open it together just to see what it looks like. I'm obsessed with this. This is my bedside caddy. This is the back. Use the Velcro to hook it on to the side of your bed. And then it just kind of sits there. I can put my books, water bottles, pencils, pens, phone chargers, my phone itself, whatever I might need. These little guys are from Target. They literally are in the name. They just rise your bed up and make it taller. For my dorm housing, I am allowed to raise my bed. I can loft it all the way up. A lot of people do that to put their desks underneath their bed to like save space. Kind of have anxiety about falling. I'm not gonna lie. Just fingers crossed I'll be okay. Next things I'm going to be showing you guys is bath and laundry. Okay, to start us off, I just have this bath towel. I chose the color teal because I feel like it set me apart from my roommates. And then to match with that, I got washcloths. I have this wrap towel. It's called a wrap towel because instead of you having to um, secure it yourself and like tuck it in, you can just get this, there's like a Velcro strap that wraps around your front and then you just secure it with the other side of the velcro you can walk around you can move around and it still stays secure so i feel like that's definitely an essential it's called shower wrap and it was literally ten dollars super good but yeah if you guys have a robe a robe would be perfect as well next i have my shower caddy i bought a kind of like mesh um shower caddy it's just black there's some shower caddies that are plastic and they're kind of like the little um holding ones with compartments but I've heard that those can get really moldy easily so I decided to get the like fabric mesh one that's kind of like water resistant I guess you could say. So I feel like this will come super in handy for everything that I need to go to and fro. I just have my shower shoes. They have holes for water to pass through them and then they have like an overall band strap so my feet can just easily slide in and out. For me personally I decided to get cheap shower shoes. I know some people are buying Crocs for theirs these bad boys i'm just gonna be using for my bathroom i'm not gonna like wear them outside of my dorm or like in my dorm room oh <laughs> can't forget about this guy poopery <laughs> i i think i'm saying it right poopery i got it in the scent lemon bergamot and lemongrass it's just a toilet spray it looks like this it sprays like that are there drops on my camera i don't think so maybe clean you sorry about that yeah you just spray it and one spray goes a long way like i just sprayed that and now it smells like lemon zest in my room i got tide pods the tide to go sticks which you can clearly see i've already used one i used to iron all my clothes i still do if there's like one little wrinkle i'll bring out my iron and i i'll use it but i don't think an iron would be convenient or practical for me if i'm like rushing to class i feel like a steamer would be super easy to use so i don't know how to use a steamer but i guess i'm gonna have to teach myself it just is universal hand steamer yeah for all fabrics all fabric friendly this is my laundry basket i got it from home sense just gonna be stuck in my closet or the corner of my room it's not that big it might look a little big but it's i swear it's not along with that basket this is a backpack laundry bag it's pretty self-explanatory you just put your dirty clothes in here and then you carry it on your back next up we have closet <laughs> Like the most essential and important thing to have in a closet are hangers so I got this 50 pack of velvet hangers from Amazon if you think 50 is a little bit too little then please let me know in the comments because I have literally no idea I've heard that velvet hangers are really good because they are like slimmer these are super thin and I just got them in the color of gray I got a lot nice 
These are just really good for tops and just saving space in your closet. You just hang um, up normal hangers through these holes so it can hang five at a time. And you can let them sit like this so it saves more space. And then I got these ones for leggings and pants. Lastly for closet, I got this. This is a three shelf organizer hanging. I could put shoes in it, I could put hats, I could put leggings, pants, like whatever I'd really like. <laughs> Just got in town, and I won't let 